Alrighty, welcome to another video. Today we'll be using Eddie Alvarez. I'll be honest, man, I used to use Eddie Alvarez quite a bit in UFC 4. I haven't used him as much in UFC 5, but this is a very, very good opportunity to get some matches in with Eddie Alvarez. And very, very similar to the fighter that we just used, um, the other fighter that we just used, we're going to, which is actually who? Who was that again? I'm like drawing a blank. Oh yeah, that was Cody Garbrandt right here. Cody Garbrandt, this version of uh, this version of Cody. Very similar to that um, with Eddie Alvarez. We're actually going to be, it's going to be a lot of like head movement. You know, that, that Mike Tyson peekaboo style where you kind of stay in the pocket. The occasional overhand, a lot of hooks, a lot of slip counters. Um, this is the UFC Fight Night 2016 Eddie Alvarez. The Eddie Alvarez has stopped Rafa. No, 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 no. Let's say it. Let's say it right. Rafael Dos Anjos. I know when you say Rafael, it's it's like if they're if they're Russian or something. But Rafael Dos Anjos, that's the way they say it in Brazil. So this version of Eddie Alvarez, as you can see right there, four and a half star fighter compared to the four star fighter that um, the regular Alvarez is. Uh, look at the character model. There's really not not any difference when it comes to the face and the body. I mean, I guess the only difference is like his eyebrows are a little bit lighter color and his, you know, his uh, his beard, he has like more of a stubble. That's pretty much it. Lighter color, a little bit more of a stubble, um, but maybe a little bit more, just a tiny, tiny, little bit more hair. It's that tiny, tiny little bit. And then of course the shorts, but everything else pretty much stays the same. Um, the stats though, um, looks like everything here stays the same besides the last perk right there, carved of wood, as opposed to like glue. Carved of wood, incoming damage is less effective when you have less health than the opponent. Um, in terms of punch speed, he's faster, he's more powerful, he's got more accuracy, he's got more blocking, his head movement's better, his footwork is better, his switch stance is also significantly, oh holy shit from 80 to a 90 that is quite the jump takedown defense uh not better it's just not not better with takedown defense kick power better kick speed better looks like uh his grappling his takedowns uh top control bottom control submission offense submission defense ground striking clinch striking clinch, okay well clinch striking and clinch control stays the same and then this is where I'm pretty sure there's going to be some significant differences. As you can see right there, cardio from 92 to 94, chin 91 to 95, body 90 to 94, legs 89 and 90, recovery 100, cut resistance stays the same. Yo, they uh, they did Eddie Alvarez really, really good, man. His uh, top moves, you're looking at hooks, um, rear naked choke, boxing combinations, lead hook, four stars, haymaker, four stars. So there you have it, man. We're going to go use Eddie Alvarez. I'm very excited for this guy. Like I said, I used to use him a lot in UFC 4. And uh, we're going to go and um, put on some boxing. Let's see. Let's see how many heads we can roll. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. We're on a roll today. We got Eddie Alvarez. Eddie Alvarez. Eddie Alvarez fighting Holloway. He's very weird. You're very weird. You're very weird. Don't be calling me weird, boy. You're weird. Spinning on me. All right. A lot of, uh, that's fine. That's fine. I will knock this dude dead very, very shortly. <laughs> Better watch it. Eddie is working with some power now, boy. Oh! oh! Wow! Wow! We got that right. Yeah, we did. Holy hell. That was emphatic. Boom! Jesus, I will take that, bruh. Look at that. Oh, yeah, we got that. <laughs> Man. He ducked right into that uppercut. 
You don't want to get hit with Eddie Alvarez's uppercuts, man. Those uppercuts are absolutely gnarly. I wish they would have given him a better uppercut animation because, you know, he kind of he throws it wide, you know. But, you know, that would be too much to ask for EA, you know. Let's move on. Yeah. Let's go, Dustin. Now, this, this fight, of course, happened twice. And Dustin Poirier, you know, did a number on him. Watch out for uh watch out for this man's uppercuts, man. We'll be throwing a lot of them. Eddie Alvarez throws uppercuts like crazy. Mm-hmm. That was very uh short. My boy. Intercept him with that cross, follow up with the uppercut. Nah. Stop it. Stop. Mm. It's gonna be another another quick KO. gonna be ggs right here man yo some of these fighters they're adding right now bro these guys are so freaking powerful you really got to be careful man when your opponent is like slipping and countering and duck and all that. especially with the new change to the head movement head movement is definitely more um like i'm noticing it's more effective now so like if you already have a style where you're moving your head a lot you're definitely gonna no you'll notice a buff to it um, like I said, my style is usually very intercept heavy, but when I'm using some of these guys, like, again, some of these really, really powerful guys, that's when we try to get head movement heavy because those counters, man, they, they spike that vulnerability. And you, you, you can really cause a lot of damage really, really, really quickly. Um, so, I'm loving the way this man feels, man. Uh, no diddy. Uh, let's move on. Hey, YouTube, please don't demonetize my videos anymore. I'm trying to be better, okay? I'm trying to be better. I'm trying to not, I'm trying to be less potty mouthed. I promise I will, uh, I will change my ways. While we knock this, uh, we're gonna knock this, uh, BJ Pan out real quick. <laughs> he shoots. Nice, nice, nice. Well timed. Too bad I denied that though. You know, a mistake people make sometimes when they see you using BJ Pen is they think they forget that you're using icon BJ Pen. Like this BJ Pen is really good. Like make no mistake about it. Oh, he's backstepping. <laughs> okay. Okay, he's showing off now. Nice head movement. Nice. Give 
me that guillotine. No. Eh. You need to work out this position. Okay, Herb Dean. I actually don't want to be on the bottom here the whole time. No. What? Bro, you're pissing me off, boy. Okay, so obviously he wants to try to incorporate some grappling here, which is smart, definitely. Uh, he definitely doesn't want to stand in front of uh, Tyson Eddie Alvarez right now. Probably not the best idea. Woo, look at that, slip into the uppercut. Probably shouldn't be doing that, but we're going to try to avoid all that grappling shit. I don't want it. I do not want it. You gonna slip that? Oh, -ho -ho. always sounds like a freaking. That was actually, I'm liking the way he's setting up these shots. Like a jab and then he just shoots. And, you know, I just have decent takedown defense. These are some nice shots as we rock him with the overhand. With the overhand right. Yeah, this will be, uh, I think we're going to stop after here. Because your boy is actually, I'm actually getting tired, bro. Again, legitimately tired today, so we're gonna stop gaming. I finished up, uh, I finished up the. I finished up the um, Cody Garbrandt Fighter Showcase, and I was gonna stop playing for the. Oh my god! Oh holy hell! I was not expecting that, dude. Jeez, Louise! That is the second fight. The second fight we've ended with a freaking uppercut from hell. These, these, these guys—they keep, they keep ducking into uppercuts, man. Boom! Look at that. That is just gruesome. Boom. Y'all need to be careful with Eddie Alvarez's uppercut, man. And like I said, it, it would be nice if they would have... It would have been nice if they would have given Eddie Alvarez a different animation. His hooks look good. His hooks look like Eddie throws them. He throws them freaking wide, right? Actually, yeah. That's the right animation, right? I'll look again. But 
the uppercuts, man. We need a, we need a wider like Ladies he's throwing it too short in the game, and Eddie does not throw him like that. He's a very mm, 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 his whole entire body into everything he's doing. So yeah, man, I'm done. We're done for the day. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like on it. Uh, I don't know what to tell you guys to put here. If you just if you if you yeah. Yeah, right on the ground, King, if you watch up until this point. All right? Thanks for watching. See you boys later. Peace out. Have a good one.